Electrolytes, by definition, are basically uh, positive and negative charged elements that are in our body and things that we consume. Electrolytes are used not only in like dehydration, but in our, the way that our heart will beat. There are calcium components, there are potassium components, there are sodium components, and all those components are needed in our body to function correctly. And without them, your heart may stop. Um, or with too much, your, your heart may stop, right? I mean, it, you always wanna find balance in that. But um, in regards to dehydration, um, these electrolytes will, on twofold, one, your body has this mechanism called the sodium glucose co-transport system. And uh, you need to be able to move this electrolyte sodium into your system through the gut. But it's kind of hard because if you don't have one molecule of glucose, that molecule is, it, it, it takes a lot more energy to move that across through the gut to where your body needs to absorb it to put it in the right spot. So in that regards, you know, you need one molecule of sodium, you need one molecule of glucose, just think of a lock and key. The glucose is the key, you put the key in there and then you unlock it and that sodium can cross right over. And then that's when our body will use it and put it in the right spot. So that's why it's so important that uh, for our formula that we have is it's, it's made specifically to work quickly and efficiently. And some people might say, um, oh, well, I'm on a keto diet. I can't take a lot of glucose or I'm watching this and that. That's fine, but you're exposing yourself some risk. You might drink this drink, but you might not absorb a lot of these electrolytes. Some people might say, well, I ate lunch and I have some glucose in the bread that I ate. Well, that's fine, but your body might have absorbed it and already got rid of it. Um, you know, different components get absorbed at different times. So if you're relying on what's in your stomach to provide the glucose, uh, it's just too much risk. So if you're in an emergency situation, say you have a POTS flare or you're dehydrated or something like that, you want that, you want to get hydrated quick, right? Whether you're on a keto diet or anything like that, you want to get hydrated quickly. So you need to move those electrolytes quick throughout your body. So that's why it's really important. Uh, to kind of do that. But as in general, these electrolytes are key components of our body's function and they are just basically like electrical conduits for our body.